I just went to an apartment viewing. This is really tricky because I am such a picky, neurotic bitch. I have agoraphobia where I live is like, ah, important. The real estate agent tells us as we're going up, the place is a little messy, the guy's moving out, but it'll obviously be clean before you move in. You just gotta look past it. Oh, bro! It was fucking nasty. It was nasty. I was viewing it with two couples or two sets of two people and I was in the elevator going down with these two ladies and I was like, and they were like, it was filthy. Oh my God, it was filthy. The whole appeal of the place is that it has 20 foot ceilings with floor to ceiling windows in the bedroom and the living room. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. The view? Gorgeous. But I'm like, is there window coverings? Because that's really important. It doesn't look like it. Oh, there is. Okay, great. Pull them down. They're the, they're the fabric ones. <laughs> Oh my god, there was there were stains. I only pulled it down two feet and saw this big ass fucking stain and I was like, those are going right back up. I'm not even I can't even do it. The walls are fucking dinged up and like scratched up and have marks all over them and stuff. Like it would need a fresh coat of paint desperately. The pictures of it online showed a different unit that had hardwood flooring throughout, but this place had this really ugly weird carpet in the bedroom and where the carpet connected to the hardwood in the living room the seam was like all frayed and fucked up and shit but my biggest problem i can get all over, over all of that right gorge gorge the kitchen this is like borderline a studio kind of it's like 500 square feet my current apartment apartment is 687 it only has like one wall of kitchen Right now I have that and then an island on the other side that has cupboards and like my sink and double basin sink. So this place had one sink basin, one cupboard underneath the sink. Right now I have two and I'm like, how am I gonna fit all that shit in one? Then there's three skinny drawers and then two cupboards above. I joked, I'm like, do you have to go on a diet to live here? Like where the fuck does the food go? Because like, <laughs> That's what the fucking shit, like that's where you put your blender and your bowls and your and your cups and your pan, where the pots go. And the cupboards were really short. Like, I don't even know if you could fit a full olive oil in there. It was like spices and shit. And the location is super dope. The view is super dope, but where do you put your shit? And there is a little den, but it's right at the front door and they have like a desk in there. To make that storage would be kind of tricky. There is a washer and dryer in the unit, but there's no place to like store anything within that little closet thingy. Where do you put your shit? And the closet doors in the bedroom were like pushed out and like barely dangling, still holding on, like all fucked and stuff. And I'm like, who is this tenant? Like when I, whenever I have a landlord or a maintenance person come into my apartment, I'm making sure my apartment is clean as fuck and like looks good because I don't want to look like I'm disrespecting someone's home. That was the most disrespectful shit I've ever witnessed. I'm not the cleanest bitch in the world. Like my stuff gets unorganized for sure. And sh there's dust and stuff, but that shower bro, ah! the tile was covered like a cream color tile covered in a thick layer of this like ready orange soap scum. All of the grout was this ready orange and like to look past, oh my God, I can't. This is why I fucked myself. Like just sleeping in there at night and then waking up in a nightmare. Ah! But the last person in there was so dirty and it's probably still seeped into the soul, seeped into the wood. Can you kick a tenant out for being disgusting? Probably not, hey? Oh my God, if I had a rental property and I went in there and it looked like that and I wasn't able to kick them out. Oh my God, I could never be a landlord ever. Ow! I'd be going full Karen. What the fuck are you talking about? If you live in my house, you need to clean the fucking shower tiles.